Garden Center in this beautiful Oak Ridge, Tennessee. I'm going to show you how to divide a water lily plant today. Um, what has happened is it has jumped out of its pot, so its roots are hanging. Uh, you don't want this in your pond, especially if you're trying to grow these in containers because it's just going to go crazy. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to flip it over on its side and I'm going to push and pull on it to get it out of the pot. Okay, we've uh, taken it out of the pot. You just have one big mass of roots and soil. So the piece that's jumped out of the pot, we're just going to break it off and that'll be its lily itself. I'm going to gently untangle and then you don't need all those roots to go back into the pot so you can rip off. And to prevent that from happening again, what you'll want to do is you see how it's growing? you want that to grow towards the middle of the pot other than jumping out of the pot. That was probably the first mistake that the homeowner made when planting. So we're going to go ahead and fill this probably halfway up with soil. Uh, you can use an aquatic medium if you'd like or you can just use a regular topsoil that you can get from your local nurseries. Soil. Let's get this guy out of the way. We'll work on him later. You'll spread out the roots. Don't forget to add your fertilizer taps. It's really going to help the plant as it starts to grow. Now I just like to add two around the roots. Okay. And now the next step is you want to gently Add your pea gravel. Make sure you want to protect the, your growth on your plant, so put your hand around it as you do it. The reason why we put pea gravel on top of the soil is so when you put it in your pond, the mud's just not coming straight up. So the pea gravel holds down the soil. And if you have a lot of lilies to divide, um, a shady location is a, is a great place to do that. Um, other, the sun will just dry out the, the leaves and, and it'll just die back. Um, so the next step, what I would recommend doing is actually putting this into a bucket of water before you set it in your pond and I'll show you why. You want to gently lower it. Just rinse the dirt off the pea gravel so you're not mucking up your pond. Um, so so if you plop it down, all that dirt and everything is just going to come, it's going to flop out. But basically that's how you divide a water lily. Thanks for watching.